Welcome to another edition of Swim Easy Speed. Today we're going to look at the importance of proper cueing in swimming. And what I mean by that is, you know, in this video you're going to watch me work with uh, Jocelyn McCauley. And, um, you know, we're trying to get her to get a little bit more core engagement. And she's working with the brick kickboard and um, just the cues that you use to try and get the engagement that you want. So, for instance, a classic example would be an athlete's crossing the midline underneath their body and you tell them, hey, don't cross the midline. Instead of, you could say, you know, keep your fingertips pointed down towards the bottom of the pool. So here you can see, you know, right now what we're trying to do with Jocelyn is um, she's a little bit like that on the water. So we want to try to get core to engage a little bit more and the legs to come up with that. Um, you know, you can tell she's already swimming really, really well. Um, Together. But we're just trying to get really a little bit fast. more core engagement. So here we put the fins on, use Better. the brick kickboard. Don't let the elbows go soft. And there what we're trying go. to do really is get out. with these cues really, really long in the water and where the core doesn't have any out. choice but to engage. Really, really long on the water. Long as you and you can, can see that the feet are starting to come there up, the hips are starting to come up. You know, those elbows aren't soft at the front anymore. And so here's where she really starts to kick. That's going to put even more pressure on the core to engage. You can see the hips start to pop up. And then we'll get here a the difference between, you know, the before and after. So you can see kind of here the feet are coming up. Hips are much closer to the surface of the water versus where we started. And that's kind of the importance of cueing. So I'm going to put down in the uh, description um, a book that came out. It's uh, called The Language of Coaching. And it really goes into a lot of the research on uh, effective cueing and uh, really the role that, that that can play in helping an athlete learn a movement effectively and efficiently. So as always, thank you for tuning in. And if you have any questions, please let me know. And I will see you at the pool soon.